We might know about viruses because they can infect us and cause diseases like the flu, herpes, and smallpox. In fact, viruses come in all shapes and sizes and can infect all life forms on Earth, including animals, plants, and even bacteria. Viruses are everywhere on the planet. In fact, one teaspoon of seawater has 10 million viruses in it. But what exactly is a virus? Viruses are made of an outer shell that holds genetic material. This genetic material is the recipe for viruses to make more viruses, but viruses don't have the tools to make more of themselves. They need to borrow tools from another life form or host. Viruses infect cells, the basic unit of life, which have all the tools the virus needs to copy itself. To get at the cell's tools, the virus first needs to put its genetic material inside of the host cell. Once the genetic material is inside, viruses can then immediately make more copies of themselves, which are then released into the environment, resulting in the death of the host cell. Other times, the virus chooses to hide and wait until the host is stressed and weakened before making more copies of itself. Host cells, like bacteria, have evolved many types of defenses against viruses. For example, bacteria have evolved protein scissors to tear apart the genetic material of viruses as soon as they enter the cell. Studying such tools has helped many fields of research like genome editing. While we tend to only think of viruses as bad, viruses can also be helpful in the environment. For example, some viruses in the ocean recycle nutrients by killing their host cells, which provides food for other organisms. Viruses can kill us, but without them, we wouldn't be here.